The city of Palm Springs is working to address a staffing issue that's being blamed for recent closures at the city's swim center. As News Channel 3's Jen Franco reports, some residents believe more needs to be done to improve operations. Swimming daily is more than just an activity for Jeff Nelson. It's part of my mental and physical health. Um, it's something I really value. He says he and his husband have been paying members of the Palm Springs Swim Center for years. But recently, there's been a change. We just got this email saying because of yesterday's storm, we're closing the pool for at least part of the day today. The email also said the pool will be closed Thursday and will reopen on Friday. Rick Minot frequents the pool to coach a swim team and says this latest closure didn't just happen for storm cleanup. I think they, they're, they hide as much as they can on the staffing issue because nobody can argue maintenance. Rick says when he went to the pool, he was told it was closed because there were not enough lifeguards working. At a city council meeting last week, Assistant City Manager Teresa Galvin said three temporary lifeguards have been hired. Our HR department has been working on a multifaceted promotional campaign. She also said efforts to recruit staff are ongoing. But Jeff Nelson fears signs of mismanagement, which include broken lockers, highlight an even bigger issue. Part of the problem is there's no real leadership here at the pool. You have to have a a, a plan for the pool. What is, how are you running it? What's the administrative way to want to run it? Both Jeff Nelson and Rick Minot say they have repeatedly expressed their concerns to city officials, but have seen little action. It just doesn't seem like things are really happening um, as 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 quickly and as uh, you know, in, in a way that's um, kind of transparent. In Palm Springs, Jennifer Franco, News Channel 3.